this is the fifth problem they said that find the 12th term of gp whose eighth term is 192 and the common ratio is 2 so we have to find the 12th term they have given eighth term and common ratio so first of all we will start with the given information so what is given given eighth term is 192 and common ratio is 2 so r is equals to 2 then next we will start we know the nth term formula what is the formula for nth term in gp it is a r to the power of n minus 1 then next if we substitute the value of a we don't know the value of a so we have to find the value of a so we will consider here nth in, in place of nth term we are having 8 so a8 is equals to a r to the power of 8 minus 1 so that will be equals to 192 and we know what is the value of r r is 2 so 2 to the power of 7 is equals to 192 the next a is equals to we can send this down so 192 by 2 to the power of 7 if we take out the factors of 192 we will get 2 9s are 18 2 6 are 12 2 4 are 8 2 8 the 16, 2 2 the 4, 2 4 the 8, 2 1 the 2, 2 2 the 4, 2 6 the 12, 2 3 the 6, the next 3 1 the 3. So how many 2's are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 6 2's are there. 3, 4, 5, 6 and 1, 3 is there. The next, how many 2's are there? 7 2's. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This will get cancelled and this also get cancelled. So what is left? A value of A is 3 by 2. The next, now we are having A and the value of r the next it will be easy for us to find the value of 12 so for finding the value of 12 we know that the formula of nth term is a n is equals to a r to the power of n minus 1 so for 12 we will get a r to the power of 12 minus 1 next what is a a is 3 by 2 so 3 by 2 into what is r r is 2 2 to the power of 12 minus 1 that is 11 so if we cancel 1 2 from 11 we will get 10 so 3 into 2 to the power of 10 so 3 into 2 to the power of 10 means if we multiply 2 3 ta 10 times we will get 1 0 2 4 then next 3 4 is a 12 1 3 2 is a 6 plus 1 7 3 0 is a 0 3 1 is a 3 so 12th term is 3072